The Zone 4 Legion Championships continuing tonight. Shrewsbury with a chance to close it out over Milford. Everybody singing in the rain at Tivnin Field. Our own Dave Bolduck and Joey Dubois were there and bring you all of the video and all of the highlights. So here you go. Shrewsbury won last night, so they're up one game to none. Top of the third, 5-0 Shrewsbury. Milford with a liner. Mike Bonolo with a diving catch. Sensational work in right field. Bottom of the third, Shrewsbury's. Chris Wright poking one deep down the right field line. That one's going to roll into the corner. Wright's on his horse. He cruises into second. He's got a double, and he's in scoring position. Mike Tonelli, his friend and teammate, picking him up. Tonelli smokes one through into center. Wright's coming home. He crosses the dish. 6-0 Shrewsbury. Tonelli's got himself an RBI. Top of the fourth. Milford. Deep shot. TJ Morgera with a nice running grab and crashes into the wall as the rain falls. Game was called after five innings. Shrewsbury gets to win 7 to nothing, so they are celebrating. They are on to the state finals at Milford. So both teams, Shrewsbury and Milford, will be playing in the state championships. Auburn Summer League playoffs, Uxbridge and Southbridge. First half, Jadeep Sidhu for Uxbridge with the jumper. Then it's Sidhu to Luke Scholar. Uxbridge in front. Sidhu all over these highlights. Sidhu putting it to the floor. Get off me! The hoop and the harm off the window. Sidhu going flat out beast mode. Inside, you cannot stop Sidhu. He splits the defense for a pair. Uxbridge with some good passing. Scholard, the finish underneath, nice touch. Southbridge coming back. Kevin Loftus in the corner. Loftus with the baseline runner, dropping it home. Then it's Sidhu with your ice cream scoop of the night. Is it Black Raspberry, the Cadillac of ice creams? We salute you, Sidhu, and we salute Black Raspberry ice cream. Uxbridge wins 53 to 40. Shepherd Hill and Milbury, boys basketball, Auburn Summer League playoffs. First half, Anthony Zaleski taking it to the den. The hoop and the harm, the hill up by three. Milbury's Micah Friedman. Going to take it himself into the teeth of the defense. Nice touch from Freeds. More Milbury. Max Colifrath with the rebound. Colifrath just ripping it away. Up strong for two. Milbury gets the win. They're moving on. 42-32, your final. Clinton and Sutton, girls basketball. The Shrewsbury Summer League, they're playing inside tonight because of the rain. First half, Clinton's Mia Hool with the hoop. Clinton up by two. Sutton dishing it out to Celia Furman for the long jumper, and we're all tied up. Sutton swinging it around the horn. Clinton's Rachel Gwynn with the great defense blocking the shot, getting physical. Down the other end of the court. Gwynn showing off her offensive side of the game. We're all tied up. Furman pulls out the rangefinder, the long jumper off the window. Sutton up by two. Clinton with the full court pass to Thana Ferreira. Back and forth we go. We're tied up again. Furman from beyond the arc. Sutton up fourth to half. Second half. Clinton by three now. Sutton's Katie Wright puts it to the floor, splits the defense. Wright going off the window for two. They are within one. Clinton pulls out the victory tonight. 19 to 16 is your final. The Massachusetts Pirates taking on the Jacksonville Sharks on Saturday night. And the defense standing tall early on. Lawrence Austin with a pick to start, stop the Sharks' drive. And how about some more defense? The Pirates, Khalid Wooten with a great read on the ball. And he has the pick and goes over the boards. But Jacksonville, who is the top team in the league, wins it 54-47 in overtime. And that'll do it for sports. That's going to do it for us here on Worcester News tonight. For Kevin Shea, I'm Ada Botari. We'll see you back here tomorrow.